with Angie Rice from the hit reality show Orange is the New Black. She's been nominated for a SAG award for Best Ensemble with the rest of her reality stars on Orange is the New Black. Can I interrupt you for a second? I play Angie Rice. That's the name of my you character. You are Angie Rice. <laughs> Angie Rice. And um, Orange is the New Black is not a reality show. It's a fictional show on Netflix. So everyone knows you're addicted to drugs. I think you're thinking of Lock Up. Have you watched Orange is the New Black? Yeah, it's my favorite reality show. It's a fictional show. How did you get out of jail? I'm not out of jail. <laughs> oh my god, she broke out and this is where she came. This is where she chose to came to. To come to. To came to? To came to, to come to. Ooh, it sounds like an African to. an African song. Like, to came to. To come to. To came to, to come to, to came to. Did, it, did you kill somebody? No, I uh, I auditioned um, for murder. For, but how would you audition for murder? I don't know. You tell me. You did it. That sounds like a like a like a book. Yeah. So for anybody who's not clear about Orange Is the New Black, it was originally a memoir. Okay, and then it okay. was made into a fictional show uh -huh, with sure. fictional characters. So I'm gonna play along. I'll play along. So Julie Lake, if that is your real name. It's been on for what three seasons coming out? Yeah, we just finished filming the third season. Uh -huh. It's so hard for me to watch you guys struggle. And in season one, when that girl killed herself, I was amazed that they showed the dead body on television. It's almost great that you believe that it's real because you know um, we're representing a lot of women whose mm -hmm. voices aren't normally heard, mm -hmm. and a lot of women are in prison, and yeah. and you know they're so dehumanized by other shows and. Yeah. I feel like you're just, I feel like this is weird. Can I call my publicist? <laughs> no, I no. Don't. Basically, the reality show got nominated for a SAG award, and yes. you and 39 other people are nominated for a Best Ensemble. Yes. So, like, what does that even feel like to get recognized for, like, you being It's so amazing that SAG has this Best Ensemble award because yeah. acting is really a collaborative art. Oh, my you gosh. Know? So, like, when... When you guys, like, all get to go to the SAG Awards, like, you get to, like, dress up, like, who are you wearing? Is it going to be, like, um, Channel or Versailles? Um, I'm wearing Lorena Sarbu. Is it pretty? Yeah. What is it? What does it look like? Is it pretty? Is it, it's I pretty. Don't, I don't want to give it away. It's oh definitely pretty. Secret! <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> She's going to look like a princess, and you heard it here first. If you win, um, and there's, like, one little statue with one little sagging face... The statue's called The Actor. So you get to win a man. Dirty boy. Well, you can't actually see any of his private parts. He's kind of got the Barbie doll thing going on <laughs> Yeah, you have to take the award home for that. <laughs> After a drink, am I right? How many times have you slept with Brad Pitt? I don't think this is an appropriate question. Well, it's but important. Obviously, it's I've, important. I've never slept with Brad Pitt, but this is not... Oh my god, that is so sad. George Clooney? How many celebrities have you interviewed? So this many. This is very strange. So many. I've interviewed a cat. It didn't go very well. Cat actually walked away during the interview, and the cat just got up and left. <laughs> so a cat. And well, when you don't... say it like that, it really minimizes my work. You're crazy. That was my interview with um, Julie Lake. Um, she is an actress, and she's nominated for Best Ensemble at the SAG Awards. That's this Sunday, five Pacific, eight Eastern. Uh, mountain time? I don't know. I don't know about mountain time. It's on TNT and TBS. Make sure you check it out on Orange is the New Black. And she's gonna look like a princess. Thank you for tuning in. Subscribe, like, give me compliments. Give me gifts. I'm so alone. American boys are the worst. They're so terrible because they're oh. always like, you're so beautiful. The American boy, he texts me constantly on my phone. He says, oh. hello, hi. hi. How are you? I say, come up with something better. How about oh, no. the sky eats the trees today? I would say, well, that's surprising. That's the sky so eats the trees. so strange. He's eating a tree. Why? I'd like to know more. About I'd like to know more about hello. They're beautiful. Oh. Yeah.